I chose chemical engineering because it opens doors to new opportunities, whether it's business or medicine. And I knew that if I could make it here, then I can do anything that I wanted from here on. I chose to be in chemical engineering because of that. Why did I choose to be in chem -eng? This is why. I went into chemical engineering because I was really interested in biology and I was hoping to be a doctor and I thought that chemical engineering would probably do a better job of preparing me for that than life science because it can take a practical approach to bioengineering and give you the same background only you're allowed to problem solve along the way. Well I joined chemical engineering uh, because uh, first because of the people, the students and the faculty and its great reputation and uh, uh, I think our uh, unprecedented unprecedented ability to solve uh, the world's next problems. Okay, so why did I choose chemical engineering? Um, I came from a family of engineers, so I kind of had to pick engineering, otherwise it'd be disowned by my family. Uh, why chemical? Because I have a passion for chemistry, I love reactions, I love blowing stuff up. What spare time? In my spare time, I like to play rugby. So during my spare time, I do research with Professor Bender in his lab on organic solar cells. Uh, throughout high school, Professor Bender was a great mentor to me in helping me develop my own unique organic solar cell innovation, which I am now taking to market as my own company. And we're the captains of your chemical engineering soccer team. We're the semester one champions. We're currently undefeated. Um, we've had an amazing turnout. Usually I play badminton in early morning, okay, 7 a.m. sometimes. And in the weekend I uh, do cycling, long distance cycling, sometimes over 100 kilometers. When I graduate, I want to help shape Ontario's green energy future. Whether it's fuel cells, solar power, wind energy, or even nuclear, there are many alternatives to burning fossil fuels that we can explore to provide us with energy. Well, my dream job, yeah, to be honest, uh, my dream job would be to be a pro hockey player. Uh, well, or if I couldn't do that, maybe a rock star. But, uh, you know, I uh, never got out of house league hockey and really couldn't play guitar. So next to that, I'm in my dream job, and that's being a professor here uh, in chemical engineering at the University of Toronto. Well, I'm going to get my master's, then my PhD, then an MBA, then an MD, then a JD, and maybe an arts degree for fun. And then I'll become a prof. That's an easy job, right? If I could do anything, I would start my own bakery. Weddings, anniversary, and an event. Any cupcake, you name it, I've got it for you. Best part is, once I start mass producing them, I can use the chemical engineering knowledge I already have and design my own process. Right now I'm working on designing materials for solar panels. Uh, we're targeting low cost solar panels with these design materials that we've been working on uh, in my lab. In the future I hope to do similar types of things, incorporating newly designed materials that I can work on in a research lab and incorporate them into uh, technologies that people can use day to day. My dream job is to work for myself. Uh, you know, I'm going to go about this uh, basically working for a couple of years, uh, get my MBA, and then uh, get into consulting, I think, on the energy side. And, you know, I really think that ChemEng just have a great skill set to be entrepreneurs.